Hey guys, welcome to another short tutorial. Today we are filming with the DJI Osmo Pocket since I have only this camera available, which is the Sony Alpha 7 Mark III. And my 5D is at my sister's place at the moment. And today we only have a look on how to update the Metabone Speed Booster. That is the fifth generation of it already and I'm using it on my Alpha 7 III in combination with Canon lenses. In this case I'm using a Sigma lens but I'm speaking about EF lenses. At the side you have a micro USB port to attach a micro USB cable. I've never updated this Metabone Speed Booster, but since I have some focusing issues, someone said to me, hey Daniel, did you already do a firmware update? No, I haven't. So let's see if there's any improvement and let's see how to do it. So first thing you need to do is to go onto the Metabones website to download this little app here. I put a link in the video description below so you have a direct link to that uh, app. If you have a MacBook, it's a pain in the ass to download this app since the firewall is always blocking to download this app. Anyways, I managed to do it and I just wanted to give you that small hint that it probably takes a bit of time until you have downloaded this app. Let's see and continue what's gonna happen next. Connect smart adapter or speed booster via USB cable. Plug into your computer directly. External ports such as the ones on a wired keyboard or a hub may not work. Do not attach any camera. Okay. Here's the Metabone speed booster. As you can see, I detached the camera from it and make sure to use a micro USB cable to update the firmware of it. Just plug it in and let's see what happens. After I plugged it in, as you can see, there are like tons of options. You can select all of them if you wish to do so. I don't know if there's any disadvantage not doing it, but for the purpose of this review, I'm gonna do it and hit update. So there was an error doing it and I have no idea why. Let's press okay and open it again. Done. EFE smart adapter has been updated. You may now unplug the USB cable. During this entire process you will notice that there's a little LED flashing at the Metabone speed booster. So here's my Alpha 7 III. I unplugged the Metabone speed booster from my computer. Attach it to your Sony camera. And for the purpose of this review we're gonna use a Sigma lens with an EF mount. Here it is. Let's see, switch it on and it's right here. It doesn't give any error messages or something. And let's test the focusing speed. Of course it's daylight, but it seems that the focus is much quicker than before. And because I was about to forget to mention it, I always had focusing issues in the corners. The center has never been a problem on my Sony Alpha 7 III in combination with all EF lenses. But on the corners there was a huge problem in terms of focusing and that issue seems to be solved now because if I put the focus in the lower left, right, upper right, left, whatever corner, it's focusing straight away. So it worked quite nice. Thanks for watching and if you have any questions make sure to post a comment below.